After 18 years as the head of USF, Dr. Judy Genshaft is stepping down as the school's president. News Channel H. Jeff Patterson joins us now live from the campus. It's the end of an era. It really is. It truly is, Jen. This campus has changed dramatically in those 18 years. Dr. Genshaft told us today that she's actually been speaking with her husband since May about this decision, but I spoke with students on campus here today that were very surprised by the news. Judy Genshaft has been the president at USF since the year 2000, coming in at a time when the university had a reputation as a commuter school. But that's changed in 18 years. I think we're becoming a more competitive uh, school, especially with our research. And I think a lot of that is because of Judy. She's popular with students and faculty. Well, I think she's the best thing that ever happened to USF. The president of the faculty senate told me just the changes she's made on campus have made a huge difference for student life. She made it a very welcoming campus for students. She made sure that, that students always felt welcome here. But Genshaft has also faced controversy, firing popular USF football coach Jim Levitt and presiding at a time when Professor Sami al Aria, a Palestinian activist, was fired from the school. It's not about the challenges. It's about how you handle them. Genshaft spoke with me about the challenges she's faced and changes at the school. Their perception is all about today and the vibrancy of the campus and the dynamism that goes on and the kind of new facilities that we're offering them. Yeah, those facilities have changed here dramatically. Dr. Genshap will actually stay in her office until July 1st of next year, but the search for her replacement begins today. Reporting live from USF, Jeff Patterson, News Channel 8.